like to thank Chandler for being by my side this whole time. She's been my best friend for a very long time and I'm just happy for her to finally become my wife. It's been a long time coming and she's been there through everything for me and we've been through a lot together already and so I know that tomorrow and every day forward is going to be smooth sailing and that we're going to get through anything. So well, we'll hope for that. This is a story that all began as Tyler moved from Indiana down to Columbus, Mississippi in the seventh grade where he met this pretty blonde named Chandler who was athletic, smart, and could hang with all the guys. Fast forward to the college years. They're both attending Mississippi State, and one Saturday at her parents' house in Columbus, and she needed a ride to Starkville. It was game day, and with everyone unavailable, she called the one person that she knew would drop everything to help her out, and that was Tyler. Chandler Reagan Jones, from the time I met you in high school, I always thought the world of you. I knew that there was something special about you, but little did I know it was God planting seeds of love in my mind and soul. You have been my best friend since then, and you still are to this day. It seems crazy to think that this day is finally here. I can't wait to see you in that dress and to feel my heart sink to my stomach knowing that you will soon be Mrs. Marchak. I know without a doubt that you will be the absolute best wife anyone could ask for. Dear Tyler, years ago when I was only a teenager, I began praying for my future husband. Shortly after we began dating, I knew. I knew that you were the one that God had placed in my life for this specific reason. Tyler, I promise to always love you, to always serve you, and to be a wife of God's design. I promise to always keep you smiling, laughing, to always be there with you throughout the hard times. And I promise to remain your very best friend for as long as we both shall live. I love you wholeheartedly, Tyler Marchek, and I couldn't be happier to become one with you today and for the remainder of our lives. Love, Chandler, Reagan, soon to be Marchek. I love it. I can't believe it. <laughs> it's finally here. Your letter was so sweet. So was yours. I literally <laughs> cried. I told them I was not going to cry, and then I cried. So. <laughs> I can't believe it. You look amazing. Just now, it started to feel really real. You look great. Thank you. Jesus, he speaks of marriage one time in the Gospels, and he said, therefore a man shall leave his father and mother and hold fast to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. And I truly believe that there is no better human illustration than what we are witnessing here today. Two very different people becoming one. Tyler? The moment you and everyone else has been waiting for <laughs> is here. You may kiss your bride. <laughs> so let's 
my privilege as a minister of the gospel Woo! of Jesus Christ that with great joy I introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Tyler Marchek. <laughs>